Hey, what's going on everybody? Um, it's Cullen here um, with the shave for today. Today I'll be using uh, Sterling Boat Drinks, um, soap and splash. Um, bowl is gonna be my captain's choice HD bowl. Brush will be not head brushworks brush I just got from Logan. Um, I've been bugging him about this brush forever. Razor today will be the Lupo 0.95 with a um, Alpha Gunslinger aluminum handle on it. Um, let's get into the sh into the shave here. Um, get this on. I hope everybody's having a good day. Um, I just got this soap. I um, wasn't too sure about the uh, scent on it. Um, and so I wanted to go ahead and use it to see how it um, smelled once it was lathered. Um, gotta say it uh, smells a lot better lathered than it did out of the tub. I'm not getting all the booziness from it. Um, my angle might be a little weird. I got this new setup, as you can notice that the camera's following me here. I got this setup um, for the channel and that uh, for my uh, um, store, I just opened Plagic Shave so I could uh, do some videos on uh, some of the work as I'm doing it. Um, and so it follows uh, my face um, as the video is going on, um, and so, um, that's water this. Um, as far as the blade I'm using today, um, I don't remember, honestly. I think it's a NASID in here. Um, but, uh, you know, Sterling, you can't, um, you can't beat the price of Sterling. Um, there's very few artisans out there um, that give you an exceptionally high quality um, shave soap um, and the volume that Sterling does for the price that Sterling does. Um, the only one that comes to my mind off the top of my head um, which is actually the quality is more, in my opinion, um, quality of like Ariane and Evans, Zangari Man. Um, but it's um, still the price, uh, very similar to Sterling. And that is three, four, five soap. Um, they have um, amazing scents. Um, the original quality, um, the original base um, was very much like Sterling. Um, And, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I applaud John Patton, um, you know, for improving it um, when um, it didn't need to be, um, but 
he improved it and still kept the cost down. Um, which to me, where is it at? It lost me. Uh, to me, um, to me is amazing. Um, you know, that he's able to keep the cost where he's kept it. Um, and still gives you a ginormous 5.8 ounce tub um, for the price he does. It, it's, it's crazy. Now, um, this thing goes goofier from time to time in case you haven't noticed there. Um, not saying I wish you would increase the price because uh, that would just be crazy. Um, but um, to me it's phenomenal that he uh, Sorry, that he has found a way to um, make such a quality product, um, you know, with his new uh, Trinity base and keep the prices as low as he's kept them. Um, you know, the, uh, the new Trinity base um, is... Um, in my opinion, um, that's second pass done now. In my opinion, it is um, just as good as any of the uh, top tier um, brands that charge, you know, 20 bucks and up. Um, why do they charge 20 bucks and up? I guess because they can. I don't know. I guess it's the same reason that, um, you know, same reason that some brush makers, um, will charge whatever they charge for a brush and other ones charge, you know, three, four hundred dollars. Um, for the same brush, but no, not. Well, what I say is the same brush, but I don't have the artistic skill to make it. So, um, you know, to me, it's just, it's me. Um, I don't see the point in spinning And spending three hundred dollars on a brush, um, they won't last forever. Whereas a uh, you know a stainless steel razor, or a brass razor, or a copper razor, um, titanium, whatever. Um, as long as you take care of your equipment, and uh, you know it'll last. But uh, I don't know. I just don't see a. Um, I 
the shave brush. Oh. You know, being around for um, 60 years, like a lot of these razors have, um, have been. Um, but, uh, you know, the handle may still be. Um, you know, the knot definitely, hello, where are we at? Crazy thing. The knot definitely won't be. Um, so... Yeah, there's that. Um, but, uh, you know, teach their own. You know, I'm not knocking you. If you want to buy a $300 razor or a brush, hey, um, more power to you. Um, teach their own, you know. Um, to me, it's kind of like... Uh, you know, we've all had the friends or known the people um, that we work with or whatever. That that uh, you know think that we're crazy for spending. Um, you know, hundred bucks on a razor, uh, but they don't think it's nothing to spend, you know, twenty, thirty thousand dollars on a fishing boat uh, that they're going to use um, possibly every other weekend for a few months out of the year, um, and then all the insurance that. Oh, what's going on? Here? A witch hazel mister has clogged, which is weird. Never had one clogged before on me. Um, but, uh, sorry. Um, The, uh, huh. you know, so I guess it's teach their own, um, you know, we all have our, I don't know, this thing's got clogged up or something. Um, we all have our toys um, and everything else. Um, I just follow up my shave with uh, rinsing, witch hazel, um, and then uh, I had a sample of the Zingari uh, Rescue Splash or what Rescue something skin potion. And I got looking at the ingredients. Um, well, I found this at TJ Maxx for like five ninety nine. Hyaluronic acid and vitamin E stuff that uh, uh, pretty much the same stuff, but four ounces for um, six bucks versus two ounces for um, twenty five dollars. So. You know, but uh, anyways, uh, yeah, so boat drinks um, definitely lathered up a lot better. Um, never showed y'all the lather. It's kind of gotten funky, but, um, you know, it was well hydrated. Lathered up good as usual, like all Sterling products do. Um, splash, um, I always got to shake it up like Mel says, Melia Mel. I don't know if y'all um, are subscribed to his channel, but... Um, Need to go check him out, Millie Mel. Uh, I think it's Millie Mel Shaves or um, something. Him and uh, Nate Barmeister do a uh, BBS Live. Um, Low Sense Skeletor. Uh, or as I 
I like to call him Nipples Nate because he's always uh, shows his nipples. Um, the drunker he gets. Um, but uh, yeah, I wasn't sure if this was going to be a keeper, but yeah, the uh, yeah the the splash definitely uh, yeah it's good. Um, I like it. But uh, thank you for joining me um, for the shave. I'm sorry about the camera mishaps. I know maybe not to uh, use it next time, but uh, I'll see y'all next time. Um, I'm gonna try to get this set up. I'm gonna be doing some uh, some other um, things coming up in the in the near future, um, and so uh, we'll see what that what comes to fruition with that. But uh, yeah, so y'all have a good night. Uh, take care. God bless and um, be safe.